boy Danny Box, baby, man. I'm coming to show y'all how to restore some uh, like 2000 to 2006 GMC Yukon headlights, man. Man, I've been looking on YouTube everywhere. I don't see nobody I know in depth video of how you uh, restore the lights. I did uh, I did the lights on a 2008 DTS Cadillac, and um, I'll show y'all in a minute, but I'm finna show y'all step by step how to restore these lights because I ain't seen nobody do it. Everybody skipping over shit. I'm finna show y'all exactly how to do it. Here goes step one. Step one, you uh spray it, you spray it down with good clean water. Real good. Get it clean. Nobody made this shit clear on the internet. Spray it down. Get your microfiber tire. Wipe it down. Get all the excess dirt off the bugs or whatever. Then, I should have showed y'all on the smaller light. Spray it down one more time. Gray at 3,000 grid sandpaper. The sand. So I'm gonna pick it up and show how it looks in a minute. They say, uh, I watched a video, people say, find a good motion. Man, you sand it until it gets how you want it. Some people think if you're saying you're gonna sand too much, you can't sand too much. I don't think so. It's too soft. Really get foggy. I ain't wanna, uh, don't mind my clothes in the background. I am watching. This is spring clean, baby. Uh, it get, it get foggy, whatever, but then you, uh, take this, uh, Take this one, take the 3000 grid off and use the, the uh, 1000 grid. Yeah. Put that on now. And this is the kit I bought too. Simple. Simple. You can spray that back down again, like you did the first time. And as you're doing it, you can tell. When you get to 1,000 grit, you can tell the difference. It's gonna be so foggy, but you, you really can tell. Like, uh, how it's going here, man. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, Utah got some big head, like 04 Utah. So I'm pretty sure this will go good on the, uh, you know, the 04. I don't see any any here like to me, but I just did my uh, Cadillac. I'm gonna show y'all. Uh, I'm gonna show y'all the finished product. Uh, next step. Next step. I don't even know how many so I say, but but this is next step. All you need is this. 
It's a compound. And we get drill. As y'all can tell, I've been buffing the hell out of lights with this one. Get your, get your um, compound. And you just dab it on there. Oh, a little too much there. Dab, dab. Y'all can see that a little. Yeah, I'm a country boy. I don't mind getting my hand dirty. So I rub it all in. Rub it in now. My hand, put my hand in about anything. I'm out of the meat out there, make soap in a tub for sinks, dishwashing liquid. Rub it on in there. Rub it in there pretty good. Yeah, all right. I'm just tired. This is why you need your drill. And go ahead and get the, get the, buffing it on in there, man. Get to looking like that right there. At this point, when I first did the first hit, like at this point, I was like, man, I done messed up. I'm gonna have to buy some new one. Uh, he come out. I know my drill like that, dude. Man, I'm gonna try that. Just sick. Drill went dead, so get what? I don't even feel like looking for the charge, man. I don't mind working my arm a little bit. But basically, I'm just buffing it up right quick. Buffing it up, yeah. Buffing it up. I might work my arm right quick. It should have went dead. I ain't charged that much about three months. Should have went dead. Buffing it up. Y'all get the point. Y'all get the point. I'm buffing it up. Well, after I buffed it, this is how it came out right here. Hey, it look good now. Mm -mm, but I'm not done. Hey. It's nice. I got one more step. After that, you're gonna need uh you're gonna need you one of these and uh some of these. Yeah, yeah right up. And then I'm finna show you why. Finna order some hair like I'm really not now. Man, if you think about ordering a hair like, man, see what this works for. Man, if this don't work, please get you some because you need some. Oh God. But man, I would recommend buying it. Now here, like if it ain't crack buff. Uh, none of that, though. Got the fog in the inside of it. I ain't no about no head like I showed by the water from the trip. I won't do it now. All right. That was the last step. You got to put the little, uh, it's called, uh, head like ceiling. Yeah, this is all you got to do. Put the head like ceiling on there. And now I'm going to put them back on the truck. And I'm going to show you how it look all together. Here you go, right there. Just throw the head like, man. It's real good. Now it's time for the HID. I had some in there, man. They was so god to put the head like and tow up. Yeah. So, uh, restore them. Yeah, they, yeah, they good now. That's how you restore uh, head lights on a 2004 GMC you can Anything really. Uh restore these two. Shot look. Yeah, they ice. And they was ridiculous. Yep. 
hari lo. Figure this out. This your boy Nana Box, baby, signing out. I showed y'all how to restore lights, man. It ain't hard, bro. Don't let nobody tell you it's hard. And don't let nobody charge you crazy, man. Figure it out and do it yourself. I'll take a little time. And I'm out.